Hello everyone, it's me, Mushroom Juggler. Uh, sorry I haven't been around lately, but I'm coming back with this. Let's play Illusion of Gaia for Super Nintendo. Super NES, if you will. Start journey, start from beginning. Uh, yeah. Alright. Anyway, sorry I haven't uploaded recently, but here we go. My name is Will. A year has passed since I went to the Tower of Babel with my father. My father and his party met with disaster. Somehow, I made it back to South Cape. I still can't believe my father is gone. I'll never believe it. When I grow up, I'll be an explorer and see the world. Somewhere, I will meet my father. Yeah, that's, that's not a bell. That's all for today's lesson. You four do your best not to fall behind. Demons have appeared outside of town. If you go very far, you must go with your parents. I'll see you guys at the usual place. I have to go home first. I'll see you guys there later. If you don't hurry home, your mother your mother will think that you were kept after school. Heh. 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 Alright, so we are Will. A young lad in the world of the... I don't know. Like always, the cave at the seashore. Anyway, sorry I haven't uploaded recently, but um... You know, I kind of graduated from middle school and the USB ports on my computer didn't work, so I couldn't use the microphone or my controller, but now they're miraculously working again, so, yeah. Hey, Will, how many times have I told you not to come up here? You have a habit of jumping down from places. Well, I guess I really can't stop you. This game, it's kind of like Zelda once the action starts happening. But it's really, really good. Now this guy here, this, this is Gaia, the source of all life. He will help you on your journey. Only one with the dark power can see this space. Will is the chosen one in the dark space. You can record a travel journal. Stop there before you depart. No, we don't need to save. Oh, yeah. You can hit stuff with that. It's a flute. Oh, hang on. I I have to jump off the building. Well, don't really have to, but... Let's go! Pokemon reference. This guy you can give things called red jewels to, and uh, I think I'll trade you for stuff. So let's go home real quick, just to show you. Just to show you little parts of the town. He won't let you leave town. This is your home. Grant, you have uh, Grandma Lola and Grandpa Bill here. There's Lola. There's Bill. Alright. Let's do this. I think this is Lance's house. No. No, it's not. Just some guy. They're playing red light, green light. Oh, yeah. She always does that. She gets scared and runs away. I think this, yeah, this is Eric's house. Will envied people born to rich families. Lance's house, he lives there with his frail mother. Lance is Will's very best friend, I'm guessing. And this is Seth's house. His parents aren't too good to each other. Anyway, let's go to the cave. This guy said suggestive stuff. Gosh, I can't pull it up. Wow. Get new lines. Alright, let's go to the cave. Anyway, yeah. It was natural for the forefronts to call the seaside cave their second home. Usually when lessons were done at the school, they gathered there to talk and play games until sundown. Yeah, uh, like I was saying, I my USB stuff stopped working. And, yeah, it just started working again. And I also went to a camp. It, it was foster music camp. It was really, really fun. Uh -huh, I'm going to win again for sure. Seth is the smart one in the group. What is it, Will? It's late. I'm playing cards with Seth. Wait a minute. Suddenly, Eric rushed in with a desperate look on his face. 
Ah, news, big news. The princess of Edward Castle has run away. They say she came to South Cape. That's all? You came in such a hurry that I thought something really big had happened. The princess is probably that small old girl, Kara. The one you like so much. Liar! Maybe the soldiers will come here looking for her. The soldiers from Edward Castle look so cool. I want a steel helmet, too. And we wait for him to come. Or we can just go right there. Everyone's here. What should we do today? I want to see Will's mysterious power. You haven't seen it. He can move things without touching them. He moved the statue that's in the corner of the cave. Will, show me again. Yeah. Uh, Will, using his flute, he has psychic powers. As you can see. Right there. And now I think we talk to Lance. Yeah. Next, pick a card. Any card. I'll put four cards face down. Pick the one you think is the Ace of Diamonds. And if you have ever played any video game ever where you have a choice between two things, you or more than one thing, you know that no matter what you pick, it will be what th what they want you to pick. So I'll pick the fourth one. Will picks up a card. It's the Ace of Diamonds, of course. All right. I'm speechless. Hey, Seth. This is some type of psychic power, right? Yeah, it must be some kind of psychic power thing. If I didn't know better, I'd think it was magic. Most people have five senses. Sight, hearing, taste, smell, and touch. I think Will's psychic power is some kind of sixth, sixth sense. What Seth says is too complicated for me to understand. Let's play one more game. And we leave. They mean nothing to us. And I don't know what that said. Uh, who cares? It's not important. I think it just says return home or something. But what happens when we return home? We get... I hate... I hate this guy. I really do. And there's a pig. Okay. Uh... Why there's a pig? Oink, oink. Very descriptive. Okay. Kind of confused how a pig could just push me without any sort of traction at all. It looks like he was slipping. Hamlet, you shouldn't snort at strangers. Is this your house? Yeah, so? Frankly, you look a little shabby. <laughs> well, excuse me. Ah, uh, I, I love Kara. She's awesome. Your father? Mother? Not here, huh? Is this a picture of your parents? My father is an explorer. He... I know. Ullman, the explorer. They say he was lost. He'll come back. Someday. Are you sad? No? I'd be sad if it were me. I'm sorry. Anyway, is there a piano here? No, there isn't. But gr Why is that... Why is there an exclamation mark there? No, there isn't! But Grandma Lolo is a great singer. They're singing upstairs now. They have such loud voices. Well, frack. What's, what's that supposed to mean? Yes, I say frack. What of it? Actually, that's the first time I've said frack in an LP, I think. Here they are. Oh my, I haven't sung like this in such a long time. Your grandmother Lola used to be a a great singer. I fell in love with her voice. That's why I married her. Ah ha ha. Oh, you bringing up a thing like that. Well, you shouldn't be surprised to hear that. The girl who was singing with me a minute ago. No, oh, 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 oh. Epic. A scream from downstairs. And there's the dungeon music. For the first dungeon. I'm just saying that now. I don't know why. It's that girl screaming. And. And they can just walk right through us. Princess, I've been looking for you. I don't know you. Be gone. What are you saying? If I don't take you home, I'll lose my head? What's with all these weird punctuations? 
If I don't take you home, I'll lose my head? I never noticed that before. What do I care if you lose your head? Princess, do you think I have nothing better to do than chase you down? I must take you home. It's the king's orders. I'm sorry I lied to you. I'm King Edward's daughter, Kara. Well, I feel as though we've met before. If we're if we were good friends. As if we were good friends, whatever. <laughs> anyway, with the death of the princess, I am leaving. So, uh if you like this, subscribe, uh rate if you like. Watch some of my other LPs. Uh, so later, I'm Mushroom Juggler. Bye-bye.